hello hello everybody this is Elissa from Mink Arts and Crafts and today we have an unboxing and today's unboxing is from Sparkle Queen Creations uh, so I am going to get right into it I haven't opened any of it this is literally how it came in the mail and this was actually shoved right into my mailbox as I've mentioned before, my uh, my post office or my mailman just likes to shove things right into the mailbox. So I am going to get right into it. Um, I didn't pre-stage and, and open this ahead of time for you guys like I normally would. Uh, so, oh, that's cute. I, I figured it would be a packing uh, tube, but I like that. They wrapped the packing tube in plastic to make sure it was securely done. And what is super cute is, because you never know how well these are gonna, like the ends are gonna stay on in the mail. And you can see right here, it says, welcome to Sparkle Queen Creations. Thank you, Heart Mitzi. So that is cute. All right, so I picked up a few different fun things get out all the goodies and a couple kits, a couple fun things. So you'll get to see all the goodies that I got. Ooh, I'll open those last. All right. So first, before we go into those, I don't want you guys to know exactly what it was yet. We will go over the goodies. So here we go. She has a loyalty program. It says receive a cover minder in the next color of the rainbow with each new order that includes a kit. Oh, that's cool. So this is my first uh, order with her that has a kit and I'll unbox those for you. And that means that I got a red heart for part of that. That is cute. I like that idea. And then you get to collect the rainbow of the hearts and you work all the way up. That's adorable. And this is I love me my, oh, that's like a little, uh, my, a big roll of washi tape. So I like that these are big rolls of washi tape. So this one is an adorable little, like a Pegasus with rainbow clouds. Super cute. All right, so here we go. Hello sparklers, welcome to the amazing world of resin drills. These high quality drills have a fantastic sparkle. You'll find some drills have tiny holes. This is the nature of poured resin. Never fear, you'll have plenty of extras to complete your project, happy sparkling. So I did wanna get uh, one kit. Uh, so one kit with a tool kit, and then the other one without a tool kit. So I wanted to see what her kit looked like. Um, Interesting, did you know your pen is sealed with glow in the dark glue? So I'll get to that in a minute, but I wanna open the bag of goodies that I got first. Uh, so I ordered some uh, extra goodies and I'm gonna go over those first. So um, anyone who doesn't know me knows, I think this is a tag along tag along uh, one. We're going to set that aside because that's probably going to go with somebody. Knows I have an obsession with cover minders, cutesy cover minders. So I saw this narwhal uh, cover minder, which this is the unicorn of the sea and is actually one of the only uh, unicorns that actually really truly exists in nature. So I had to get the narwhal cover minder. And then I like that she packs the cover minders on stickers then the unicorn cover minder with like the classic unicorn that you know this common unicorn motif Ooh. very strong magnets as you can see they just jumped you okay there baby my dog's got a little bit of a cough going on we're gonna see how far apart we can get them without them jumping sticker And uh, because June is uh, Pride Month, I wanted to get some rainbow um, washi tape. So I got the U Pegasus washi tape, rainbow washi tape, and uh, some just sparkly star washi tape. All right. Boop. 
boop. It's a rainbow cover reminder. Ah, there's the one that goes with this one. This is a cloud with the rainbow whooshing off to the sides. These ones are smaller cover minders. I thought those two were very similar and went together. That one goes there. Lollipop. Does anyone automatically start singing lollipop? Lollipop. Oh, lolly, lollipop. In your head when they think of a lollipop. But I love oh, that one's really pretty. So, lollipop. Cover minder. And a rainbow cupcake cover minder. So those were the cover minders that I went with. There's a couple stickers. Boom. The washi tapes. Boom. The freebie. And let me go ahead and open up the toolkit so you guys can see what the toolkit looks like. So. You get, ooh, uh, some oil drip tweezers. Relatively flat, they're not pokey tweezers. So that'll be interesting to see because I feel like the most tweezers are super pokey and it's hard to grip anything. And I'm like, I want something that's broad and flat. So I'm interested to see how those work to be able to pick up like the flat surface of the drills. And then she's got her little sticker for Sparkle Queen on there. They've got that oil drip finish to make them all sparkly. And this I love. And it's sealed with glow in the dark glue. So that is fun. And I wanted to see how does like the actual toolkit go. I love that she has these filled with all of the color, all of these rainbow drills. So there's little square drills in here to give them the rainbow look. Uh, and pretty much everything in her shop is colorful, rainbow themed. Uh, pretty much everything that you find from her shop. Uh, so there's this, which I already read her uh, her thing. You get the you get a typical boat for a flat boat uh, tray for your drills. You get a multi placer that you can use. A, oh, that is cute. I like that. Um, so you do get your little like blue, bluish gray wax, but she put a little uh, sticker, a little diamond sticker on the wax. That is fun. I like that. That was cute. And then you've got your stickers. Uh, so here is her business card, Sparkle Queen Creations. Be the queen of your sparkles. There's her business card. And then here are uh, some stickers. So you get that sticker there. There, I love this one right here. That's like my favorite. That's a super cute one, koala. And a rainbow. So add those stickers over there. And this is the basic toolkit right here, as you can see. So this is the basic toolkit. And now I'm going to show you the two, I got two kits uh, from her to try out. So I'm gonna go ahead and open those for you guys. But first, I'm gonna go ahead and move this out of the way. All right, now that I have slid the cover minders off to the side with my washi tape, I am going to show you my two canvases that I purchased from her, my two kits. My favorite one is going to be the first one that I show you. And when I showed my mom a picture of this, she just shook her head at me and laughed. And she was like, you did not buy that canvas, did you? And I was like, of course I did. Boom. I thought this was just epically adorable. Uh, so look at that. Uh, this is the cutest thing ever. So this is from uh, Sparkle Queen Creations. And you can follow her on Insta at, with at Sparkle Queen Creates. Uh, so as we look here, we're gonna take a little tour of the canvas. So you can see there's her logo. This is uh, not like that creepy soft felt, but it's still kind of got that, like it's not stiff and hard or anything like that. Um, so Sparkle Queen Creates, uh, and you can see her website, sparklequeencreations.com. Here's the image. You've got the super cute 
little uh, emoji with unique at the bottom. This is a 30 by 40 round because I love me some rounds. And I also, if you've been following my channel at all, you know that I love me my small canvases. That's my preferred size. I love being able to knock out like a good 30 by 40. And uh, I'm excited to be able to do this one. Uh, so because it's small, there's really no need when you have something small like this, you really don't need a legend on both sides. And honestly, I don't even use the legend really when I'm doing my kit. I just, I'll use it to like verify am I on the right track. But once I kit up in my, cause I like my Elizabeth Ward containers, I don't even use the legend. I find that that slows me down. I put the symbol on my Elizabeth Ward containers. And then from there, I'm golden. I just follow, say, okay, what symbol am I doing? Okay, good. And then I go from that symbol from there right onto my, uh, right to my, from look at the symbol here, say, okay, which one of my little Elizabeth Ward containers has that symbol, grab it and off I go. I don't even look back here unless I need to verify that I'm doing the right thing. But you can see here is our canvas. We're gonna look, there's our, legend over here on the right you can see this one has how many colors is that oh i think it shows i'm not going to count those it'll show on the uh drill uh, thing how many colors it is then we come it does have a few a b so we've got one two three four a b's in this one so depending on which ones are a b's will dictate whether i decide i want to do more or not because i feel like this would be one that could use some shimmer in it depending on what the ABs are and then you can see the rainbow poop emoji artist because I mean like let's be honest that's a rainbow poop emoji but I mean how cute will that be to do this rainbow poop emoji I'm excited for it uh, the artist is Denise LaFauci Snyder uh, so I think this is beyond adorable and now let's take a look at the drills so I already took them out of like the the super crunchy squeaky bag and you can see this is how they come you've got your baggies here um so you've got your ab 3865 right here ab 605 i had to look i'm really bad at reading I, you would think you know doctors were supposed to have um horrible handwriting but that doesn't mean that we can read our own horrible handwriting we can read our own horrible handwriting, but not necessarily everybody else's. And then AB602. Ooh, I like that color. Ah, I love me some pinks. And look at that pink. Ooh, that's beautiful. Love it. Love it, love it, love it. And this is one where the AB310 is actually going to be like a gorgeous, will go well with this kit. That will be like a regular 310 would not look well here. Because that AB310 is going to go right down here in the unique that's going to be ab310 and i think that will actually go will look really good to have this sparkle a little, little sparkle sparkle shimmer uh my mom laughs at me when i say that it does use the little baggies but for such a small canvas i think that will actually go well so we've got our 3865 little 819 I do like when they separate the colors like this uh, so you know kind of what you have so there's an 819 which is very pale pink I should turn the, let me pull it down so you can see there's an 819 you have an 818 which is a soft pink as well uh, boom, boom. let's go ahead and turn the canvas over so you can actually see those colors. There's our 3865, 819, 818. I already mentioned there's our ABs. I'll go over where they're located on the canvas a little bit later. Uh, 3866. That one I'm like okay that's got to be a 603 look at me struggling there 603 604 there's a lot of pinks in this one 894 it's actually a fair number of colors in here 3824 I think that one is a 
151. Okay, I should just look at the log right here that tells me what colors I have. So there are 39 colors in this right here. So, uh, yes, that will be a 151. Helps if I actually look at these to be like, oh wait, what do I need? 3706, 967. The fact that these are so small and I don't have a ton of baggies of these makes it a little bit better, but these are like my least favorite baggies or these tiny baggies. Uh, 3855, and then we roll into a 598, and I'll grab that because I know that's annoying. My air conditioning just turned down. 3825, but I'm super excited for all these colors, and this kit was adorable beyond belief. 605. 3856, 3340, that's a fun color. 165, ooh, a yellow. Oh, I love this minty green. 772, and we get into a little bit of a blue. 750, 3752, 3746, a3609, and then we we'll roll into a 3841, 352. I'm not gonna bring all the colors directly up. 369, ooh, 341. 744, 722, almost done. 156, 794, 340, 155, 3608. This one is just straight 310. So we do have a, a string of straight 310, which is not bad. And then this will be the background, which is 963, which is a really pretty color. And that's an actually hefty bag, but look at that beautiful 963. So that right there is going to be our colors that you can see. That's a pretty, really pretty spread of colors. I'm excited for those. So now I'm gonna clear these off and we'll go back over and I will show you our ABs. All right. So looking at this kit here, we have our four ABs. We have the AB310, which as we look at it, that is going to be this uh, black asterisk symbol. And if you look at the canvas here, you can see that the symbols are pretty clear. I'm like, there's not any areas where it's hard to read the symbols. And this is around, and I love the fact that there's not those guide circles, so it's gonna be easy to cover everything up. And I like that it's not a lot of letters, it's just, symbols which makes it easier to follow um there's nothing confusing or anything that area might be a little tricky well i guess that's this one the black that you see right there is just straight ab so that one's not going to be bad to do because it's just straight regular ab's and then you can see the only star like asterisk that we have is just down here on the unique that's the only one that we have and then as we come uh, our next ones that we have, let me see if it's better if I just zoom in as opposed to doing all of the, all the things. Um, that way we don't get as much glare. So our next AB, we have 602, which is this little heart symbol. And as you can see, the heart symbol is actually in the hearts. Uh, and actually the other three ABs are all in these hearts. So the 602 is going to be the heart, uh, which is going to be this pink right here and then our 605 is going to be the money sign which you see right here which is this lighter pink and then the 3865 is this white which is going to be the diamond diamond that you see right there and that's going to be for all three hearts and that's the only ABs that we have in here are going to be the the three hearts right there those three hearts and then the unique right down there so i'm debating whether i'll have to see how it starts to look i'm debating if i'm going to want to do any extra bling uh, i may kind of bling up like this little area here those little like highlights i may decide to bling some of that up or i may say you know what i kind of want to like scatter some blinginess into the background or do a border bling on some of it, I haven't decided if what I wanna do or if I'm gonna leave it as is. 
we will see more to follow on this one here. So now, as I hit my precariously balanced washi tape, try not to have that. All right, everybody. So this is editing Elissa. Uh, as I was going through and editing this video and getting ready, getting it ready for uploading, I kind of decided at the last minute that I wanted to split it into two separate videos, one for each of the uh, canvases. So that way it wasn't like a super long video and you could have two shorter ones to watch. But rather than making you wait like a really long time, like a week or so in between the two unboxings, uh, they kind of go like really close together and they do really go together. So I'll be um, uploading one video today, obviously, since you're watching it right now. And then you'll get the other video tomorrow. Uh, so that's why I'm going to do it. So if you wonder why it kind of seems a little choppy, uh, like right now, it's because I'm kind of doing like piecemeal, like a little bit of the parts here and there from each of the videos. And that'll be why, I guess. Yeah, weird. Uh, anyways, also you get to see my face for like the first time ever. Normally you just see my hands like floating around on the screen. Uh, but yes, so now we will go back to the actual video and you get to do the video instead of just like looking at me and my hair that needs cut because I'm getting a haircut in like, what day is today? Uh, I'm filming this clip on a Tuesday. I get my haircut on Friday, so this will be a little bit more tamed on Friday. It feels like very overgrown. And anyone who's ever pending a haircut, you know how you don't really feel tame and you feel kind of like, ugh, until you get your haircut and you get your haircut and you're like, ugh, I feel so much more human. Or at least I feel so much more human once I get my hair cut. At least with like the short hair. F what? Anyway, anyways, I digress. Back to the video. And back to Rainbow Poop Emoji, which is like a super spectacular kit. And I have already bought like special drills to bling it up. Uh, both this kit and then the next kit that I'm going to unbox for you. Well, that you will be watching the unboxing for uh, on my next video tomorrow. You will, well, you will be watching it essentially tomorrow because editing world is different. Anyways, back to the next video. I am super excited to try out both of these kits. Uh, and I've got the drills uh, right here. We will give the drills a try, see how they go. I got them both in round. I believe you could try, I'd have to double check but I, on the website, but I think you could check out whether you wanted, uh, or you could choose whether you wanted round or square or some of the kits you could choose she had some things that were in round and some things that were in square, something to that effect, I can't remember. I'd have to double check and look. But of course, I got the round kits because I like my rounds uh, because rounds just are so much easier to lay down and they go so much faster. And then of course, this adorable array of cover minders to add with to my uh, overflowing collection of unicorn themed cover minders and you know fun cutesy cover minders and a few more washi tapes to add to my washi tapes and I figured if I'm having rainbow kits I had to have some rainbow washi tape to go with the rainbow kit so hence there we are anyways I hope you guys have a wonderful rest of your morning evening afternoon whatever time of day it is that you are watching this video and if you have not already clicked the like button down there and if you've made it through my ramblings and uh, oddly hyper and off the wall uh commentary today this yeah if you've made it through this video click that like button and if you're not already subscribed please subscribe to the channel and then you can expect some more odd ramblings and odd commentary and stream of consciousness, I guess you could say, whatever it may be, uh, we uh, and go from there. But other than that, I will link the shop, her website down below so you can check out the adorable canvases that she has. And I will see you guys in the next video.